Hello guys, how's it going? This is Isaac Bandragon, and welcome back to the moon. Now we are going to... Oh. Okay, we jump over the fence apparently. Okay, now we're going to do this memory. On the... On the earlier... On the... Not, not so old Johnny, I mean. Okay, now we are here at the house before it got built. So it looks a little... It looks abandoned though. Tools flying around everywhere. Oh shit, I... I'm sorry, I didn't. <laughs> okay. I bet I saw this cliff and... Thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. So they just abandoned the house because it's pretty much... It's, it's actually pretty da dangerous to build a house over here. And there's Johnny. What is he doing? Sorry. Okay, no, just almost up. Nothing to worry about. Who's that? Oh, Isabel. Nick called and said I should come. So, probably she's Nic Nicholas' wife on the previous episode. What, are you, what, is, what is she going to do here? I brought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? Oh, so pickled olives actually. Johnny's favorite. I, I was mistaken. I thought it was rivers. Okay, there's Nicole Olive. I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed, diagnosed in its late stage. Fortunately, it's, it's treatable. But the medical bills... We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. So yeah, that, that's what he was been lying about. He's lying about his finance on the previous episode. To rip to river, saying that he c he can afford the medical treatment and the house as well. But it seems that he can only do one. He can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved that she'll be okay. But you don't know how much this place means to her. I don't know too. She's going to be heartbroken. I'd help, but Ted and I have been barely getting by since the market crash. Everyone's on the on the bad side of the life there this time. What are you going to do now? I'm I'm going to tell her that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. So yeah, he, he will lie. I don't want her to do anything crazy. You shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she'd, which she'd choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when you neurotypicals think you know what's best for others. Um, I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what neurotypical means. Can you can you look at can you look at look it up for me? Maybe I'll look it up myself later. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? Yeah. What about me? What about me, John? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. You and everyone else in the world. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from this cliff and bring back to her. It'll at least give her some comfort. That doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. What's that? Nick wanted me to give you this. Oh, it's... It's a music box. He said he's called everything's alright. 
Which doesn't suit the whole condition today. It isn't, yeah. It's nothing's alright this time. Is he picking up flowers for a river? Okay, we're back in control. And now we're going to see Okay, I can yep, I can pick up the music box and oh oh. That's the memento. Let's pick up some more of these orbs. Um, what's over here? Okay, so the truck was also so the pickup truck was also a part of the orb puzzle, and the, and the house is also too. Memory links may also be acquired from exploration. Oh, okay, that's what that's why we got the orbs as well. Okay, nothing else to see here, I think. So let's just go where John is. And we got two right out right of the bat. And what is he doing? Yeah, I think he's going to pick up flowers for forever. So this is this what so this is this is the part where reverse illness still not still not being a terminal a terminal disease like we have seen before in the earlier in the previous episode. And um, oh yeah. I didn't see that, sorry. Two, three, four. Oh no, get! Okay, let's go prepare the memento. And as usual, they will be puzzled, I guess. Yep. Um, ideal three. Hmm. Okay. Well, this one is actually pretty easy. Let's pick this one and... Oh. Yeah, that can do too. Bingo! It's just too easy for me. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that thing, that thought will never bite me in the ass later. Receive note, pickled olives. Okay, wait. Let me read the memento. Let me read the notes for a bit. Um, pickled olives, Johnny's favorite. And I think, yeah. We got this from the, from the earlier. A song Johnny was... A song Johnny wrote for his deceased wife. Its title is a placeholder. Okay, so let's just save the game over that over here. Um, 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 um. Okay. Okay. Sorry, my friend. I have to activate this. There you go. Off we go to the more later. I mean, uh, yeah, later memory. Where is this? Seems like we're in a bar or something. So you guys are really going for it, huh? Yep. The construction is starting in just a few minutes. In just a few months. A few minutes, sorry. It's a bit of a squeeze. We had to split the payment. But with financing, we'll make do. How wonderful having your dream house built at such, at such a beautiful site. Although it says dangerous. I mean, what says dangerous? You had your wedding at Light Lighthouse near near there all those years ago, didn't you? That's not all that's special about it. We have a long history with that place. So I guess it has something to do with Anya. But it's good to have some good news at the get together for once. Cheers and congrat cheers and congratulations, you two. Cheers! Be right back, I'm gonna get some fresh air. Me too. Reaper's been silent all this all that time. Okay, so I guess they will be having some girl talk over there. While the men will have their manly talk. Well buddy, it's sure been a while. Hasn't it? Who knows how hard it is to get across a few cities nowadays? I thought this I thought this takes place on the on the near future. Why it, it should be a lot easier. I mean, there's a, they, they have some kind of memory memory dive technology. But whatever. That river still so quiet, huh? Yeah, she's actually been talkative at home, and with Isabel. I guess she's just not used to you. <laughs> so I'm the bad guy here, huh? Uh, 
why does the music change? Oh, hey, did, so did you tell River that thing from back then? I did. So how did she take it? Well, for the most part, she took it well. But something bugs me. Ever since the incident, she's been making these strange rabbits out of paper. Oh, so that's after something happened to River. It's not. It's not just her hobby, making hundreds of origami rabbits. Origami rabbits. Yes, lots of them. <laughs> I used to fold origami animals for my daughter all the time. What's wrong with that? So, I don't think it's the same thing. She's been doing nothing but making the same rabbits, day in and day out. Until there's hundreds of them lying around creepily. Our house is literally filled with them now. Didn't Isabel say that something like that is a common trait for with River's condition? Yes, but something doesn't feel right this time. When I ask her about it, she never answers. Instead, she gets this distant look in her eyes. It's almost as if she wants something from me. It's not, it's not, it's not like that kind of say, right? And the strange thing is, I feel like there's something I owe her, too. Have you asked her something? Yes, she she said she talked to her about it, but I got nothing. But but got nothing. So maybe they're talking about the same thing or uh, upset. But I'm certainly not one to inquire. But I'll tell you this. I've known you since middle school, and you're notorious for overthinking. You're probably just imagining things. There's no need to get too worked up. Yeah, it's just your imagination, buddy. Unless there's actually something happening, we don't know yet. Usually when someone says that, something's always wrong. But I'll give you the benefit of the... You're probably right. Probably? I'm always right, John. <laughs> Smartass. I think it, yeah, I, it's, it's just the same as Wops, I guess. I'm oh, sorry, that. Wait, so even he himself never knew what was up with those rabbits? Forget about stupid rabbits, we got bigger problems. It's a combined memory, and there, there are no mementos everywhere, so you can go outside. Don't worry, we can probably draw, we can probably draw one out from him. How? Leave it to me. I just gotta give the bartender a quick visit first. Bartender. Oh, so there are people here. There's one guy. There's one. There's someone here. Some, I see his uh, figure of shadow. And there's the... Uh, yeah, I think this is the bartender. Hey there, could I get you anything? Hey yo, can I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash your credit. Check. Uh, I'm sorry, we don't take checks. Oh, just put it on my tab then. Wait, does that mean you you don't have any money? Uh... You're so getting reset. <laughs> just, just reset again and do the whole thing all over again, huh? Hey there, can I get you anything? Hello, can I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash or credit. Just put it in my time, I feel like spending big today. Oh, thank you, sir. Here are your pickled olives. Thanks, bro. You'll be getting an enormous amount of tips today. Thank you, sir. <sighs> You're such an ass, Neil. Oh, I'm losing up. Well, we got a pickle olives now. We have to give it to him. To John, man. Oh, so in Neil is not in the invisible mode. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I, did, I didn't notice. Why, is that a pick bottle of pickled olives you're spotting? Yeah, you fellow olive lover. Indeed I am. Just got a fresh bottle of them myself, in fact. Mind if I join you? Sure, why don't you grab a seat? We'll bo we'll down a bottle together. Oh, yeah, that sounds just swell. If I disable my simulation now! Oh, Neil, I don't think I feel like it. <laughs> 
Yeah, no, Neil, Neil actually mentioned before that he that he hates olives, pickled olives. I'm so gonna get you back for this. So that's how we got our first toaster. <laughs> uh, <coughs> you get her? Yes, I'm just savoring the amazingness of pickled olives. They're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah, I just can't understand how anyone could find such thing to be disgusting. Take your time, we got two bottles left. Oh my god. <laughs> so I said, hey, that's not right. And they totally agree. Hang in there now. And you know what else is wrong with society today? One more bottle. Yeah, I actually have it right here, why? May I see it? Ah, okay. Here it is. And... Freeze! Finally, dear lord! <laughs> how, are, how are the olives, Nile? Oh, shut your mouth! <laughs> oh, shut your mouth! He's really... She's really, she's, she's really enjoying it, this... Isn't she? Okay, so we have to... Is that the paper? Yeah, we have to... Wait, don't you dare... Don't worry, sheesh. See? I'm doing by the books. Did they just... Yeah, they just inserted the orb onto... Johnny here. And the fifth one. Seriously, I'm trying to get into this and you're ruining the mood. Totally worth it. Yes, yes. I guess it's a payback for late for earlier. Okay, so the hourglass looks different. I guess we're going to jump further again today. Memento, prepare. Okay, what's the puzzle this time? Give it to me. Okay, this one's actually easy. Cheers. Just like that. Too easy. Okay, let's see. Anything else we can do here? Nope. Let's jump. Activate the memento. Then we're back at the lighthouse. Yep, this is the adult. Johnny. That one was the old Johnny and the last one is the grandpa Johnny. So they're going up the lighthouse. Wait, was that Johnny in River? I I wasn't paying attention. Crikey nutcrackers! <laughs> You're Australian. Who cares? We're like two plenty villains now. The billion nanometers off the ground and standing on a damn flagpole. Just jump down, it's not like you can't be hurt here. It's not like you can't be hurt here. Are you kidding me? It's a freaking sky drive! You guys stay on here, you can't get off. God, I hate it when it happens. I swear to. <laughs> Eva, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, you're just all, just all talk after all, aren't I? Wait, where did he go? Okay, there he is. Why would they abandon her like this? Her? I suppose she's just no longer needed. Wait, are you telling me Anya is actually Lighthouse? They name it, they named the Lighthouse Anya? No longer needed. 
By ships, I mean. You know how it is now that everything has GPS and all that. Look, river. This place means a lot to me too, and I've been thinking. In our current state, things have been pretty stable. If we say, well, in a few years we could afford to build a house on top of here. It's going to be squeezed up. We'll be able to see it from the window! In the morning, at night, we'll always be nearby. We'll always be nearby. And, and we could walk here anytime. She'll never be alone again, John. I'll be able to wash over here every day. Oh. So River River's actually a an energetic girl. <laughs> yeah, we will. That's so sweet. Good for them. You gotta be kidding me. You remember what happens, don't you? It's like we watch it's like watching a trade wreck. Yeah. When you know what's gonna happen next it's always bad. The ending isn't any more important than any of the moments leading to it. The important thing is that over here, they are happy. Let's move on. Well, this scene is uh, this scene is really sweet if you don't know what's gonna happen to the next. So let's just hope that we we can see something more. Happy at this, at this memory because I don't want I don't want to remember the, those bad things that happened to them. Wait a minute. They were referring to the lighthouse as Anya, weren't they? I suppose so. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Then that river, she declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse. Isn't it a bit too extreme? I've seen stranger things in the course of the job. Me too, but ugh, I can never wrap my head around it. Well, I can actually. Um, should I show you? Never mind. We'll, we'll talk about it later. It's none of our business anyway. She's not our client. Receive note, Anya. Okay, let's read the note. The abandoned lighthouse by the cliffside. So they named the cliffs the lighthouse Anya, and they have been treated 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 her like some kind of a daughter, probably. I'm gonna save again, but I, I guess. And uh, 24 minutes. Should I should I end this? Yeah, I guess I should. So that so that's the third. So that's the fourth part of our adventure. And now we're going to end this episode, but at this point of, of Johnny's adult life. And we're going to continue it later on the next, on the next episode. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you do, please feel free to leave a like or a comment. And if you want to see more videos that I've done, you can just go ahead and click on the annotations after this. Or you can just subscribe to the channel. And with that being said, I will see you guys later.